Hi guys, um, this video is going to take you through how to apply to masters in biomedical technology, biotechnological or biomedical engineering at um, University of um, Tampere, Tampere University or Tampere Universities of Applied Sciences. So this is one of the universities in Finland that offers um, free tuition master's programs in this coming application round. The application would open on the on the 13th of March and it ends on the uh, 27th of March. So if you are interested in applying to this program, then you should watch this video till the end. Secondly, I've um, seen someone who passed through this particular um, second round application and I've mentioned the person Kingsley. Kingsley came through this um route last year and is currently studying in finland so if you're interested in this program watch this video because i'm going to put you through on how to apply to this program biomedical engineering and biotechnological engineering so the first, the very first step is to understand the basic information about this program the program is a university education and it's taken in english and finnish so this doesn't mean that you have to understand Finnish 100%. So, and then it's a two year program, which has about 120 ECTS credits. It's a daytime teaching and at the same time the contact teaching. So what this means is that um, you have to be in Finland if you want to study this program. And one interesting thing about this program is that it is free of charge, like um, automatically free of charge upon admission. So you don't have to stress yourself about scholarships or about funding from any uh, body. Okay, let me take you through the application procedure. The very first step is that you should fulfill the um, eligibility criteria which is that you must have completed a suitable law university degree, which is bachelor's degree or suitable university of applied sciences degree. So you need your bachelor's degree certificate or, and transcripts in order to apply for this program. And then if you're taking the finish part, finish um, route of this program, you are required to have a um, um, Finnish language, what's it called, but skills. Well, if you're not taking the what's it called? If you're not taking the Finnish route, it will be very, very important for you to mail the university before the application opens that, oh, you are an international student and you are interested in taking the uh, English route of this program. Then you will understand how you're going to go about it. Then uh, the maximum student of 20 will be selected for this program. And um you should be ready to submit a motivation letter um, to apply for this program. You need your motivation letter. And based on what you have here, the discretion of selection is the, the selection discretion is based on your previous studies, which has to be in line with um, the master's program you are applying for. So let me quickly show you some of the programs or some of the bio, uh, uh, bachelor's programs which might be related to this program uh it's not necessary that you you should have exactly um bachelor's degree in any of this field 100 percent, but it should be something related to the program because this is a medical um program so you need uh you need to have studied or completed bi biomedical informatics molecular mole uh, molecular biology and uh, cell technology or something related to that, or you should have bachelor's degree in biochemistry, biology, biomedical informatics, and so on. So all these area of natural sciences, life sciences are qualified to apply for this medical program. Then um, you can apply to up to six applications in this particular program, but you can't apply more than three in Tampere University. So you should apply for only three programs in Tampere University, and you can also apply to other universities 
up to six applications and you it's possible so while you're applying because the application will open on the 13th of uh, march you should be prepared with your your certificates of previously com completed studies is very important and then uh, you should uh, be ready to get your selection by july 4th 2024 that's the date and you should expect your admission by then one funny thing about this is that you can always appeal if you're if you're not given an admission look at what they say if you think the decision regarding student selection is incorrect you can demand that the decision be corrected after the publication of the results for from july 4th so this is why i would encourage you to send a mail to the university about your previous studies tell them about what you studied and remember to mention that you studied in english and what will be the uh, specific requirement to get this uh, particular admission so it's very very important to contact Sampere university this is where uh, you can contact them you can contact Sampere universities through these channels and there are what's it called email address as well which you can always uh, send your mail to them so let's quickly talk about the attachments you need during this application. First and foremost, you need your bachelor's degree um, certificate. Secondly, you need your official transcript. Thirdly, you need your motivation letter, which is very, very important. I would say that if after your transcript, motivation letter comes next. Your motivation to apply for this particular program. I've made a video on how to write a motivation letter. So especially i gave an example of my motivation letter which i used to apply for um, study in finland so you can always go through the motivation letter and then you ad adjust yours with that or you can do something better than that then you need your cv and you need um, some certificate of relevant work experience so this is all you need to understand about this application now this document i'm viewing with to you is a translated document because if you go to their what's it called if you go to their website it's always in finnish so the information for to this program will be in finnish which you might not find it very easy to interpret so i've made it very simple by copying this information i've, I've i made a video about other programs as well you can check other programs from the video i'll be uh, that that comes up next in this particular video you can ch check the video for other programs you can apply to apart from this particular one and i showed you how to translate from this particular language to english language so th that's exactly what i did to have this particular document here so if you're part of my community on whatsapp group i would share this pdf in the whatsapp group so you can as well get it from there join the whatsapp group if you are interested in this document and at the same time the links to this um, program will be attached to the description below thank you for being part of this video and bye bye